hi everyone welcome to dream webters youtube channel in today's video i will show you how to restore a deleted file by windows defender and windows computer so if you want to use any exe file which looks like suspicious and which is might be harmful for your computer then your windows security and defender will instantly block and delete this file immediately so how to bypass windows, secu windows security and defender and uh, how to restore your file let me show you first of all let me try to uh, copy the file that i want to run here it's an activator kms loader so if if i open the kms loader and uh, drag and drop here to unzip the kms loader you will see an error message and it will immediately be blocked and it will not be moved here okay just drop here and you can see it's uh, error message here and if you want to uh, allow this file just click here and you can see the file that is just blocked click here and select allow on device okay click start actions and click yes okay the the file is now allowed if you just click try again it will be copied and you can see kms auto.exe is now here if you want to open the file maybe it will not be uh, Op correctly open if it still block this file but if windows allows the file as you can see here i have already um, allowed the file here in my windows so double click here and see if it works yeah it's working and no error message is showing that means the file is now allowed in this device and you can now copy the file you can do everything with this file this is how you can bypass windows security and allow this file so let me show you how to find the allowed files in your defender double click here in the icon windows defender and virus and threat protection and click allowed threats if you click allowed threats you can see here my file type is kms auto you can see here kms auto kms okay uh, auto kms is now allowed allowed threats uh, the windows the windows system is now thinking the file is now okay to use but normally it uh, caught this file as a suspicious file which can be harmful for you or which can be a hacking tool but i know it's not a hacking tool it's just an activator this is how you can allow a block file in your computer which is blocked by windows defender and windows windows security i hope you understand if you want to get more details you can just click on the windows defender icon and click virus and threat protection and you can see protection history uh, how many files were current time blocked restored and you can see everything if you uh, if you find that some uh, threats were already deleted you can find them here you can see it was deleted you can start actions and you can restore the file if you want the file is now in your computer but it is not visible because windows defender has made it uh, unvisible for you and if you restore here your file will be restored here but you can see here is the destination local like c users and here is the temporary file you can see local temp and kmsauto.exe so this is how you can find the allowed files and the protection history and everything about this uh, windows defender but it is okay or it, it is good it is a good practice to uh, turn the windows defender on so that any virus or any other hacking tool cannot do any harm of your computer but as it's an activator i know it's safe to use that's why i am that's why i enabled and i allowed this file in my computer if you have still any question don't forget to comment below and thumbs up this video if you like my videos and don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel dream web to get more tutorial like this i will see you in another video bye